Boy, am I black. This is Anarchist of Darkness, also known as Kill Colorstruck. Hey, Cameron. I haven't seen you in a long time. I haven't seen you, like, in person in a long ass time. I think it's been, like, a year or two. Yeah, I did notice that about the, uh, the teachers. I know DC has been changing. DC really has been changing. It's been changing a whole lot. Like, when I got here, it was really all black. But when I would hear people talk about it, like, White people are moving in, I would hear it like that because I'm from Jersey. I'm not, you know, the part of Jersey I'm from, there's white, black, Hispanic. At first, there really weren't that many white people. Then it's like white people started moving in, but didn't really move anybody out because there were like gay white people. Anyway, I'll get into that another day. Teachers Fighter in DC, I wasn't, I wasn't, um, I'm surprised I haven't run into you, Karen. I'm really surprised I haven't done that. But anyway, because I've, I've been up and about a lot. It's mad crazy because. When I was going to Coma Educational Center, it's right around the fucking corner. I have a brother and sister, Bam and Daisha. When I was going there, was two white people, the science teacher, he eventually quit. He kind of looked like Bill Nye, the science guy. He quit, and then, um, but there was this other one, and her name is Dr. Kalapathakos. Honestly, I'm not I think she was Greek or something, really. I don't, I don't know what type of white she was. I think she was Greek. She was Roman, Greek, it was, it was something, whatever. Dr. Kalapathakos. She was real nice. I liked her. She eventually became the... The vice principal, and everybody liked Dr. Kapitalik with Dacos. Everybody liked her. She was a nice white lady or whatever, right? She was, a, you know, one of them stuck-up white ladies who don't give a fuck about you. She actually cared. Like, she cared enough, like, she actually cared enough. She entered me in the, the citywide um, science fair. She entered me in the citywide science fair. I won third place for my research in medicine. Right now, around the corner, let's take a place that's weird. I was walking by. It was like four white teachers out there. I'm like, really? And 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 keep it keep in mind, DC in this part of DC it's blacks and Latinos. They're white people, but the white people either homeschool their kids or they got some secret private school that they send their kids. These kids that live right here. They're the same age as Bam and well, well Bam. They should be around the corner in middle school. I mean not in middle school in pre in pre K or kindergarten. They're I don't even know. I think they get homeschooled. And then there's some Indians down here. No, this whole block right here is white people, but at the end of the block, some Indians, and they're like Bamidash's age too, and I don't even know where they go. I'm not worried about it, but you know, I guess it's just it's a majority black Latino school. They don't really want their kids associating with that lower class, I guess. But I, I guess since they're moving in. They're moving us out. Well, with black people, I'm not going anywhere. This is, I'm not going back to Jersey. I don't you know. I'm going to stay right here in D.C. I've grown to like it. So I'm going to stay here, okay? And plus my my surrogate family. Not, well, not surrogate, but my family. That's my family. That That is in my blood family is here. And I would like to be around them. Unless I go to California, which I, you know, I'll probably move somewhere in like the Bay Area because the Raiders play there. I'm so disappointed in the Raiders right now. Anyway, um, yeah, they're, um, I'm not going anywhere. And, and I know that they're, they're moving in. And when they're moving in, they're moving people out because they, they bought up a whole lot of land. And like, now they got condos for like $1,500, $3,000, uh, like now for rent. I mean, like for rent, whatever. Okay. I mean, not condos, apartments for like $1,500. I just know that minimum wage black people who live, a lot of them live here, won't be able to live there. Around the corner used to be an apartment building. My best friend's grandmother used to live in there. They skyrocketed the rent, knocked down the walls, and turned it into a fucking condo. It's like, was it, it, it used to be like 60-something apartments. Now it's, it's, it's way less. <laughs> it's way less. It's condos now. So, I guess since they're moving in, they're moving us out. They're getting ready to have, you know, around the corner they're going to have white people going to that school, you know, a public school, so they don't have to keep paying for their kids to go to, I don't know, um, where do their kids go? I don't know where their kids go, okay? I would have to, like, paint myself white and pretend that I'm white. Hello, how are you doing? Um, I have three children, and I was wondering if you could give me a good idea for a place I can send my children that is safe. I don't want any niggers there. So anyway, I live in Tacoma Park, and Tacoma Park is 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 culture friendly, but they're culture friendly, but I mean they're 
there's gay. There's like a there's a whole house of gay people that live up the street too. I think this lady over here is that lives right next to us is gay too. But anyway, yeah, I think that they, they, they're just tired of paying money and they want to move us out to like the PG and the, and the, the Virginia and I think it's mostly PG in Montgomery County. They want to move us out there so that way they can have this place. I think that's wrong too. It's kind of what they. It's like kind of what they did with the Indians. Only they're doing it without bloodshed. <laughs> but yeah, I'll talk to you later, Karen. But yeah, I've noticed that too. That school went from just about zero white people to like eight, and I haven't even seen all the white teachers yet. I've seen a whole lot. I haven't seen. I haven't seen all of them, cause. The kids told me, you know, I got this teacher, blah, 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 blah. But yeah, um, yeah, I have to, uh, hit you up later. I haven't talked to you in a long time. How you doing, girl?